Good morning. It's day three. Question is day four. Day four. We're going to go to Icy Street Point today. Uh, it's about 7.30 in the morning. I have my time lapse running. Look at this gorgeous, gorgeous view. Uh, I'm going to hunt for some coffee and then we'll start planning out the day. as we're pulling into Icy Straight Point. We've slowed down, so we must be almost there. Pretty chilly, but not a cloud in the sky. Up on deck 11, still don't have my coffee yet. I got distracted by this just gorgeous view. I love being up here on the top. A little bit of wind. Not too bad for chilly, but uh, just gorgeous. Good morning. Alright, coffee's been acquired. Uh, we're still we're still probably about an hour or so away from Mason Street Point Port. Uh, I'm supposed to, supposed to get off the boat there around nine or so. It should give us plenty of time before our excursion. Really looking forward to it, but also I like, really like taking in these uh, these views from the balcony. Just about in port at Icy Strait. The ship is in the middle of doing a 180 to get rotated into uh, where it can berth right here at the dock. the mountains so we had just gotten off the ship in icy straight point we had to go all the way up here to the venture center we've got a few hours that we're just going to wander around and check it out until our kayaking tour that we're looking forward to so here we are icy straight point was actually just a destination that was constructed uh, by uh, by a local group and um, it's actually not the name of the town the nearby town is actually and, uh, and, and Huna, of course, is, uh, is a native Alaskan group and, and so on. So this, this pier was only constructed in 2016 to accommodate the first ship. And then really, I think just last year, they've added the, uh, added the second pier to accommodate two ships more at one time. Let's go check it out. Does this stop at Epcot? Or Animal Kingdom. Yes, it's just really, really long. The Riviera Resort. Oh, yes. Riviera Resort, please. <laughs> Alaska Resort, please. <laughs> Are we in Alaska or Orlando? Yes. Oh, hey. There's an orca. I don't remember the last trip where I just... Every time we get off somewhere off the ship and we're, I just have to stop and... 
take a breath and look at where I am. I'm just like, wow. We have a kayaking adventure in a couple hours. We're looking forward to. It's just God's country. It's just unbelievable how beautiful it is. It's mild today too. It's like maybe 68, I think. And there's not a cloud in the sky, which they say is unusual. It usually rains. All these stops are like, it's usually raining. So we have just looked out on the weather. So this is a former cannery turned into a museum, a couple of gift shops. Just a beautiful area right here, part of uh, Icy Street. I think it's also owned by the uh, the Huna or the, the native folks to, uh, to the Huna uh, town. So just, again, again, I'm just taken aback by just how beautiful the whole area is. It's amazing. What do you say? I have counted 24 sea stars. And there's definitely more. I just lost count. I don't know if anybody remembers or saw the Alaskan Bush people. The show, the series. They had their cabin up here at the top of this. Uh, this bay in, a, in another little bay called Salt Lake Bay. But uh, this is about 22 miles up, two and a half miles at its widest, and that eagle right there, just beyond the eagle, it's 550 feet deep. Mm. Ready? We're headed down, we're gonna follow our kayak. Hop in the water. They say we may see bears, whales, oh my. Keep paddling for me. Where was the eagle's nest, he said? I'm looking. Oh, there it is up there. There it is. There's an eagle's nest up there. You won't go. This is kayaking in Icy Strait Point, Alaska. Look at the mountains behind me. Oh, it's so beautiful. We happen to catch a gorgeous day, not a cloud in the sky, about 68 degrees. This is this is the good stuff. See, there's Brennan and, and Dad. Beyond them on the shore is a bear. See that little dot? It's a bear. Look at him. There's a cub with Mama. Look, bear. Bear. It's a mama bear and her cub. It's hard to see the baby from here. So that's a parental mama there with cub. We've been able to 
kind of get pretty close to it. We're watching her posture so she doesn't run away. Isn't that cool? Look at that eagle. He just flew like right over us. So we've just finished with our kayaking experience. It was awesome, totally incredible. Uh, I'm sure you've seen the videos. Uh, it's it was it was amazing. It's really once in a lifetime. And uh, now we're headed back to the ship. I think we've got uh, what, about an hour or so to make it, and uh, plenty of time. See you on board. We are back on the ship after a long day in Icy Strait Point. We explored the port, did some things, and then we went kayaking on the water. And oh my goodness, it was amazing. The, the snow-capped mountains behind us, and then the highlight had to be, we came around this corner and there was a brown bear and it's big mom, is a mama bear and a baby cub. It was so sweet. I couldn't believe we got pretty close and she finally trotted off into the woods, but we were there for a little while, got some video and some pictures. It was amazing. splashing her. <laughs> yeah, it was a little damp when we were done, but it was okay. And once it comes off, you stir it up it's and so it resembles regular old miso soup. It's most delicious. It's good miso. This is an Alaskan California roll. So it's a California roll rolled with snow brown. This is a rainbow roll, which is basically an Alaskan California roll topped with various kinds of fish. Delicious. <laughs> yes, they are. Trying eel for the first time. Let's see. <laughs> I'm not sure of that reaction. It's 
It's because of the sauce. Is it good? The sushi is good. The sauce is disappointing. <laughs> eel sauce is one of my favorite toppings on sushi. And this eel sauce is very, very smoky. And I, I don't like that. We are on our way from Sushi on 5. <laughs> What kind of gelato did you get, Melissa? I got rum raisin and hazelnut. Mm. Yum yum. Nice. Um, so it's been a great day today here at Icy Street. Really love the experience today. Uh, right now, look how bright it is. It's 9.45 p.m. And, uh, and, and oh my gosh, it's, it's been such a long day and we still have a pretty jet lagged. So uh, I, I think we're gonna call it, uh, call it a night here pretty soon. Yep. Uh, tomorrow's gonna start pretty early. We're in Juno tomorrow. And that's gonna be super exciting. Join us then. <laughs>